Okay, Rich. Yep. First of the day yep. on the Paul Davis Drive. Yep. What's the name of this place? It's the Millennium Coastal Path Visitor Centre. All right. And it's recommended for cracking views from the little cafe that's on the LP there. Yep. And uh, what we've seen so far looks pretty good. Oh, we'll have a walk round and look round, shall we? Yep. Let's go for it. Right, so we've moved along the coast a bit to Bury Port Harbour. It's about a 15 minute drive, but the Millennium Coastal Path that was on just back there continues through this way. Yeah, looks quite pretty, so we'll have a look around. Okay, let's go. Sign of it now, Trev. What's that? The tin works. Yeah. She closed in 1953. Old oh, part of the site now houses Parsons Pickle Factory. It's a very pretty area. Isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. Crossing trip, let's all get our feet wet. No, I think we're going to have to walk back. Some great beaches though when the tide's out, aren't they? Jesus. Okay, Rich. Yep. Uh, place number three. Yep, a kid willy, and we're going to take a look at the castle. Another recommendation from Paul, and it looks a good one too, so let's go check it out. Yeah? The town seems as if it's got a carnival on, so. Yeah, it looks like. I think it's kid willy carnival today, so we might see a parade or something a bit later, perhaps. Okay, let's go and look at the castle right. then. Ah, 
Point your head. Yeah. <laughs> How's your knee, Rich? You better. Might be able to hear the carnival in the background. We chose the castle and we missed the car uh, the carnival. Oh. Hello. Can they put it on just for us, Rich? That one's very much down to it. Very nice on the side. Great old things, isn't it? I hope the wind's not spoiling this for you. Well, what'd you have for breakfast? <laughs> I'm going to zoom in on a few of these tractors a bit more. It is so good. Well, I'm glad we bought you some of that. Where we're looking out. short interlude let's get on searching around this castle rich it's quite a, it's nice isn't it yeah what i like about it is as well you get into all the little interesting nooks and crannies they're not roped off so you have a really good look around and it you know before i forget it was only four quid wasn't it four quid for me it's only three pound twenty for you <laughs> is that because i'm better looking if you say so dear <laughs> no it's good value excellent it's worth coming up here pay four quid just for the views you know? Looks interesting. <laughs> Didn't think even for me. Because <laughs> you look quite small. <laughs> Again, I apologise for the wind. That's the price we pay. Certainly worth the climb. This is bigger than you first think. Well, Mr. Blogger. Yes. I was quite impressed with this place. It's fantastic. Um, really, really nice. Before we go on to the next place, worth every penny of four quid? Absolutely. You could spend hours here, you really could. And uh, Plenty of places to take the weight off as well, so sort of bring a little picnic if you want. Or, yeah. yeah. The staircases are a bit tight. Yes. Um, but I suppose I managed them, so... <laughs> Anyone less fit than me uh, won't be able to do it, but I think it's accessible to most people, isn't it? Yep. And it really is quite spectacular in the beautiful Welsh sunshine. And another top suggestion from Paul as well. Yes, indeed. Okay then, Rich. Yep. Last place? Yep, uh, Lahan, I think it's pronounced. Uh, I'm sure someone will put me right if it's wrong. And, uh, yeah, so far looks cracking. Another castle. They all Welsh like their castles, don't they? Yep. Um, I think we're going to have a walk around there and uh, check out some of the views. Okay then. Then we'll have a bit of lunch, yeah? Yes.